Hi, I'm Dayang and today I will be showing you how to use our Generative AI plugin to create a recruitment management process application. So this application can actually help to ensure that the recruitment process is done in an organized manner for both of the recruiter and also the candidate. So let's start. We begin at the app center as usual. I'm going to go ahead and log in as admin. And now I'm going to click on design app, create new app, and I'm going to select the generative AI. So here we are going to have to give an ID to the application. I'm going to name it as recruitment process. And then the app name, I will name it as recruitment management process. Okay. So now we will have to give a description of what we want the application to have. I'm going to ask the AI to create a recruitment management process application. And I will briefly say what the process should include. So it should include job opening first, followed by job application, and then interview scheduling as well as the offer letter. Now I'm going to click save and I will give a few minutes for the application to be generated. So now we wait. Once it's been generated, we will be automatically directed to the app composer. So here we can see the form builder, this builder, UI builder and the process builder. So let's look at the process builder first. So the process starts with the um, job opening. The recruiter will publish the job opening, followed by candidate submit job application, which then the recruiter will review. So if it's shortlisted, they will schedule an interview. So the interviewer will conduct the interview. So if that is a pass, then the recruiter will send out offer letter to the candidate, which he can then accept or reject. Okay, so the process actually looks good. Now let's look at the forms. So we start with job opening. So here are the details that they will provide in the job opening. We have the job title, department, location, description, and the requirements. Okay, that looks good. Then we are followed by the job application. So this is what the candidate can provide. He will provide his name, his email, his phone number, resume, and cover letter. That also looks good. Let's look at the interview. So here's the interview, has the details of the interviewer, the date, the time, and the location of the interview. That looks great. Let's look at the offer letter now. So here we have the job title, the department, location, training date, salary, and benefits. I do not see um, a place to upload the offer letter, so I will go and include that here. So I will call this offer letter. Okay. Okay, I think everything looks good. Let's go and publish it so we can see what the app looks like in real time. So now back on the app center, let's look at home. So now we can see that the application is up. Let's click on it. Okay. Room management. Let's submit a new one. Okay. So job title, let's give it a test. Title. New title. New department. New description. New everything. Okay, once that's done, the recruiter will see this and click complete to publish the job opening. So now the candidate can submit a job application. Okay, great. So here the candidate can see, let's say, new candidate, new email, just 000. Resume, I as usual have a test document for this. We have new cover letter. Okay, complete. And now the reviewer can review the job application. Here he sees everything. If it looks good, he can download it by clicking here. If it looks good, he can approve it. So once that's approved, 
you can schedule an interview. So here is the recruiter scheduling the interview for that particular title. So you see this is actually a duplicate. We can actually change this on the form builder. Interview date, let's say 31st. Interview time, new time, new location. Complete. So the interviewer will then conduct interview. So if everything was good, he can add comments. Great, let's see. He approves it. So now it's time to send out the offer letter. So the recruiter will send out the offer letter. Again, we have the duplicates. We can definitely remove this in the form builder. So let's say they are joining on 2nd February. So salary, let's just say 100. Benefits, new benefits. And then the offer letter. Complete. So can indeed can look through the offer letter. He uploads. He can download it by clicking here. And if he agrees, he can click complete. And now it's done. So that is the recruitment management process. Um, I hope that this was helpful. Of course, everything is customizable. You know, we can remove the duplicates easily on the form builder as I had shown. Um, yeah, I hope this helps and good luck on your adventures on the journey. I thank you.